Hi, I'm Sean Yarbrough, Vice President of Product Line Management at ST Engineering iDirect. And I'm Paul Tillman, the Senior Director for Spectrum Technologies with Microsoft Azure Space. Today we're excited to talk about how STE iDirect is taking our satellite communications technology into the Microsoft Azure Cloud. Our migration is happening in several key phases. From migrating our network management system to virtualizing our remote modem, and then moving our hub and baseband processing to the cloud. You know, one of the most challenging elements of this is virtualizing the modem. That's where we take something that's traditionally a piece of hardware in a satellite communications network and convert it into software. Today, we're going to showcase a really important milestone. Taking a virtualized modem, now running as a containerized piece of software on commodity computing in the Azure cloud, able to demodulate high data rate satellite signals. So let's look at what this means with a real life scenario. What you're seeing here on my laptop is a disaster recovery team providing a real-time assessment to their command center in the cloud. We are sending video file over a simulated downlink to an iDirect virtualized SEPC demodulator. This is all hosted on Azure hardware. The video file gets demodulated by a virtual modem on a commercial off-the-shelf server, as you can see here in our demo lab. This is the video received by the command center after processing in the Azure cloud. This virtualized demodulator can receive traffic through a digital interface instead of the analog L-band interface we would normally use. This is the result of our work with the interoperability standards to replace the analog interface with a Diffie digital interface. This successful demonstration on Azure hardware is an important milestone towards realizing the vision of a fully virtualized modem. Virtualization allows us to orchestrate, load, and provision software modems, not only at the remote site, but at the ground station as well. From a cloud computing perspective, we call this hybrid cloud. That's where we treat compute resources at the edge, just like compute resources within the hyperscale cloud. At the ground station, modem software can either be co-located with the antenna, or we can digitize the signals and use Express Route to bring them back to the hyperscale cloud and demodulate those signals there. So this milestone is amazing because it allows us to take satellite technology and architectures and deliver them on commercial off-the-shelf hardware and cloud technology. With this, it allows us to bring broader services to market faster with more security and higher scale. This collaboration and partnership is really fundamentally about empowering the space community. Our work here with iDirect represents a really important milestone and Sean, I look forward to future innovation. Absolutely. This partnership and these innovations are critical towards our strategy for our next generation ground infrastructure that will deliver on a cloud-based, multi-access, multi-orbit solution.